be honest, I don't even know where all my stuff went, like the things that I bought. So some of these things are not here, and some of these things are like just random stuff. So I'm gonna get started. I'm gonna get started. I got a couple stuff from last month and this month accumulated in one video. Some of the things I don't have and I don't even remember what I bought during the summer. So, and some of the things I've already worn, so I don't have it at the moment because I actually wash the things that I buy. So let's get started. Um, this is basically a back to school haul ish thing because I have some stuff that I bought or was given to me that works for school and is for school. So, so I'm gonna start off with random ugly stuff that I don't really care about. First, I got printer paper and this is from Target. Um, most of the school supplies that I picked up are from Target because I love Target. So yeah, you know, college life. Then I picked up some notebooks. I got a green one, purplish one, a red one, and a white one. Just for the four subjects that I'm gonna be having this semester. They're five stars, so five stars is the best. Um, but yeah, this shower caddy thing. It was at the dollar aisle, but it was really three dollars. Yeah, it was just a shower caddy, plastic caddy, and you could use it like when you go to the restroom because I am gonna be living in an apartment so I had to pick this up moving on to beauty I picked up a lot of things this summer first off my sister picked this up but I'm gonna add it to the video because we share so Sally Hansen nail polish is this nice blue nail polish that I have on right now it's really really pretty it's in the shade babe blue and I love the name and I love the shade it's a really nice blue color so yeah this is the sponge I don't know what it's called it's the Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge and I heard some good stuff about this so I decided to pick it up and it was like cheap compared to the original, the OG Beauty Blenders. I heard it's good for concealer so I decided to pick it up. So. Then I picked up four liquid lipsticks from Colourpop. As you could tell, you could see the pink things on here because it's been a month and yeah, long story short, I got four of them. I'm doing a review soon, so wait for that. These are like the most neutral shades because I'm not a lip person. So I picked up a Clueless, Lumiere, Beeper, and Stingray. They're just really nice liquid lipsticks. Shout out to Kate for recommending some of her liquid lipsticks that's her favorite. I had to get four of them. Then I got four primers from Smashbox. These are all from Love Princess o or AP Class. Um, she gave me the set and so I just took them out because it's been like a month. She picked up the 24 hour photo finish eyeshadow primer and this is supposed to work for your eyeshadow to make it last all day. Then the Smashbox photo finish primer water and I heard a lot of good things about this so I'm really really excited. I've already tried it but it's like I can't really tell the difference yet because I'm really oily. So this is supposed to help make your makeup last all day. The photo finish foundation primer by Smashbox. Box. This is the clear version and I'm really really excited because I heard a lot of good things about this But I haven't tried this one yet. I tried the green one and that was great So um, also she gave me the under eye primer And I'm sorry if you could hear Neil the under eye primer by the way, so I got that um, I also tried out this new BB cream I don't know when I'm gonna upload the reverse impression But it's the covergirl clean matte BB cream for oily skin and it's supposed to help for people who have oily skin I still like the Maybelline one better, but you'll see the review soon and just check that out. Okay, AP Class gave me a lot of stuff, so the next thing I got is the Nomad Makeup Eyeshadow in Desert Sands. It's a really nice gold shade and it's uh, perfect for summer or any occasion or any season, to be honest. It's just a really nice shimmer color. Can you see that? You can't really see that. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna swatch it real quick for you guys. So it's a nice, it's a gold color for summer. She also got me the Smashbox Double Exposure Palette. I'm gonna do a review on this soon or just a, you know. I actually got a brush with this, but I don't know where I put it, so I'm really sorry about that. But it's actually 14 shades that are nice matte shades with nice shimmer shades. Perfect for a day to night makeup look or everyday look, basically. So, yeah. This also came with a mascara, but I don't know where I put that because I don't have eyelashes. But yeah, it's a cool palette. Then she gave me this highlighter, but I could use it as a blush slash highlighter. It's a DLS highlighter, baked highlighter in the shade Bellissima. It's this nice pink shade with a nice reflex of gold. Oh no, it's a really nice highlighter. I'm wearing it today, but kind of kind of greasy, so you can't really tell. But it's a nice color. So yeah. 
Then I got brushes from Kate. I got two of them. These are really great brushes. I really recommend them. They are the Wet n Wild brushes. She gave me this crease brush, but it works for anything. You can use it as eyeshadow, um, brush, or concealer brush, blending. And also this eyebrow brush because I was missing eyebrow brush and now I got one. So I'm really thankful for that. Thank you. Then I also got some BH Cosmetics brushes. I don't know how fast this video is going, but this brush is from Smashbox. This is a double exposure brush and I found it. This was with the palette, but it looks like this. It's just this nice crease brush with eyeshadow brush. It's perfect. Then I got these BH Cosmetics brushes because I really wanted some eyeshadow brushes that are really nice. So I picked these up and these are really cheap. It has all these brushes right here. I'm not gonna zoom in, but um, it has a concealer brush, eyeshadow brushes, eyebrow brush, and a crease brush, and all these nice eyeshadow brushes that you'll need for every day. So I picked this up. Yeah. Moving on, I got a palette from Morphe, and I'm sorry, I love the palette, but I hate the packaging, probably because it's really cheap, but um, this Morphe palette is really, really great. I really recommend it, and Neil is bugging me right now, sorry. This is a 350 palette. It's not the shimmer, all shimmer, it's not the all matte. It's half shimmer, half matte. I love it. It has some nice neutral shades, perfect for everyday looks, or night glam looks, whatever, smoky eyes. Very affordable, so I really recommend it. So yeah, pick that up. The last thing I got was this eyeshadow from Love Princess. So again, this is the Urban Decay Single Eyeshadow in the shade Lounge. You can't really see, but it's this really, really beautiful eyeshadow that's green. But then when, you know, when the light hits, it turns reddish. Yeah, it's just really pretty. I'll insert a picture if I find one, but I'm not sure. So if I don't remember, comment down below if you want to see that. But yeah, it's a really nice shade and it's perfect for, you know, a cool look. Moving on to clothing, I got a couple clothing items and some of the items I don't remember where I put it. I got this white blouse from Tilly's which I cannot find so um yeah. First I got a pair of jeans, oh, my mom picked me up some jeans, I was super happy, from Hollister and they're just this nice shade of blue. I already have got a pair of these but this is just different, like it's a little bit different. It's straight. If I fold them on the bottom, I love Hollister jeans just because they're soft and that's it. But other than that, I mean, you could find other affordable jeans, but they're really, really soft. A shirt from Forever 21, I already wore it. I just wanted to show you guys. Is this, I got a lot of white shirts, but exactly what I was saying. I put the white shirt in the washer and this is another shirt that I got that's white. So I got a lot of white shirts. I got this shirt from Forever 21. It's just this nice white shirt that has this nice embroidery detailing in between, like in the middle. And then it has some in the bottom so you could see through. So if you wear a bra, you, you have to wear something underneath it. So it's just this nice white shirt. Another green jacket. So, well, I, I think it's a jacket. I wore it to um, Monterey Bay. So if I have a picture of that, I will put it somewhere around here. But if I don't, this is a jacket itself. It's, oh, oh, 1982. Never mind. It's just this nice green jacket with, um... What are these called? I'm not sure. But it says 1982 DMA M2 EVP. I think it's Olympic program. I'm not sure. And then it has some nice pockets and then these nice little, um, I don't know what they're called. I'm sorry. The corner of the thing, it says Art of Ocean Nature Grounds California. I think this is the last thing I got from Forever 21. Um, it's this t-shirt that says 1-800-BE-QUIET because I love Drake. But not as much as, you know, like, five sauce. But it says 1-800-BE QUIET because I always tell people to be quiet, sadly, in my house. So it says this. And it's just this nice light blue shirt that I'm going to be wearing tomorrow. Heh, <laughs> for school. <laughs> okay, so the last place I went to was this online shop called romwee.com um it was my first time shopping there i was so excited but then um to be honest don't be excited sometimes because sometimes it turns out different so so i picked this up and um long story short it doesn't really fit me um just because it's kind of big so i picked these overalls up and it's i guess it's kind of like a jumper um i don't know uh it looks like this I think it's really cute, but it's not like, I don't know how I'm gonna rock it yet because it's kind of like big. It's just light wash, and then towards the bottom, it's kind of like boyfriend jeans. Um, but it looks like this, and it goes all the way down, and yeah, I love the shade of the pants, so it's 
like if only it was just pants by itself but this was really cute it has this nice a big pocket in the front so then you know um, it'll be cute when you go to a concert so yeah hey that's cute together what do you say so the last thing I got from Romwe.com was this jacket. I got it because it was so cheap and I love it so much except for the size. It's just really, really small. Um, it's this nice yeah. bomber. Bomber, that's what it's called. This nice bomber and I love it because it's so different. Um, online it showed up differently but this is a size small and it was kind of really small but um, it's still okay. I like it. It's shiny and all that and it's perfect. You might see my sister wear it at school so if you're watching Watching this and you go to my school or my old school you'll see Jella wear this because it doesn't really fit me like all these stuff I got are not fitting me so I think that's all of the things I got like clothes I didn't show you guys everything because this video is gonna be too long okay so now moving on to school stuff because the first stuff I didn't really include the backpack and stuff so I'm gonna show you guys that so I picked up well I didn't pick up I got this as a gift it's so cute it's a bag. Pack. My aunt and my uncle bought me this backpack from Kate Spade and it is just really sleek. Um, it's also from Neil and Rain. They got me as a gift. So it's so cute. Just really cute and small. And I don't like wearing a purse around. Well, I do, but like backpacks are easier for me just because like I always lose my stuff. And I'll put everything in here. So it's really cute. And yeah. Okay, so the next thing I got is this. Oh, so heavy. North Face backpack. And I just like it because it's so black and I love it. And it's so basic. But it's so expensive. It's really good for like college and all that stuff because it's like so soft and then it has like this nice buckling in the back so you know like your backpack won't fall off and stuff so I love it I love North Face it's really really easy and I love it because you could put your computer and all these stuff in here so I'm gonna I would show you guys what I got in here but not yet because that's a different video the last thing I got was this MacBook Pro and I was so happy I got this. Um, my mom and dad and Jella got me this for my graduation gift and I'm really really happy, really really blessed for everything that I received for graduation and also this bro and, and like I'm not going to be using the iMac anymore just because I'm going to be moving so I love this. It's really really pretty. Also I love the, the black matte shell on here for case. It's just all black and matte and I was just, it's from Amazon and it was really cheap. But it's perfect just because I can always buy a new one. And I just needed one at the moment just because I don't want the screen to, you know, mess up or anything. So, yeah, thank you for that. So that's the end of the video. Hope you guys all enjoyed. If you guys like these type of reviews or videos, comment down below. I like sharing my stuff just because I love watching these type of videos. It gives me an idea of what I want, what I want to buy, and what's out there that I could buy. So if you guys have any other questions, comment down below. I'll talk to you guys later and... Also, I want to give a big shout out to um, all my friends out there and also best friend Big Al or Alan. Um, if he's watching this, I want to say hi and you guys don't know how great he is. So if you guys want to know, I just want to give a shout out to him. 